what I'm saying, if it, if it gets clearly away at, at first base or whatever, um, you don't need to give a mechanic. At second base, because of all those different scenarios, you need to go ahead and give a mechanic, okay? Even if the butt, anytime it hits leather, say it hits leather and bounces 30 feet away or whatever, but at second base, there's a higher expectation for to give a mechanic there because of all those different trouble things, okay? Um, the other thing to keep in mind here, when you're giving mechanics out here um, at second base, is this is the time when your back is actually going to be to the crowd, to the dugouts, everything else, okay? Um, whereas when you take plays at first base, you know, you might do an out mechanic right here. Everybody can see it in the whole ballpark because you're facing them, all right? When you're out here at second base, your back is to them. So you can't bury your mechanic out here, okay? Burying your mechanic is getting it too low. If I've got an out call out here, I want to make it nice and high and visible, all right? So everybody can see that back there. Don't bury your mechanic like this so nobody can see it in the dugouts or the rest of the field or whatever else, okay? Another thing is, <clears throat> with your pull, uh, if, you, if you have a play where he's out because he's pulling it out, okay? Make sure that you're doing this up visible where people can see it, okay? Same thing, don't do it down here where nobody can see it. Do it up here and he's gotta be an up and down motion, not this. What's this look like? looks a lot like a safe okay so don't do this don't do out he's pulling it out all right that looks like an out safe right out pulling it out make sense 